I just wanted to show you. I did the uh, bus today and I didn't video it at all because I just didn't have the time to do that. To set up cameras and everything like that. I've only got one day to do this. I started at 9 o'clock this morning and I finished the clay to this point uh, about 6 o'clock. So that was a good, well, good nine hours of uh, working on the clay. I think it, I, I'm happy with how it turned out. It turned out looking like them. I've got to work on the ears yet. I've got detailing to do on the mouth yet. Uh, the Todd Connor needs to see the, the clay. Uh, and he's certainly going to have some points of view because he knows his father better than I do. But I'm happy the way it turned out. Not bad for a day's work. It looks like them to me. And let me tell you, I was ready to throw in the towel. I, I, this was hard to do because I had a hard time seeing it. I used my magnifiers. And thank God I got these magnifiers years ago. Uh, without them, I, I'd be sunk. But I was ready to call it quits. I was going to tell them I can't do it. And then I just said, look, Terry, and this is who I'm sculpting, is Terry Connor. Terry, if you're there, help me! And then things started picking up, and I started getting it just perfect. And I put the last touch on this thing, which was a button right here on uh, the shirt. And I heard a chair behind me squeak. And my chairs don't squeak on their own. So I almost had a feeling he had been here and left when I finished. I, at least I, no, I, it couldn't be just my imagination. And uh, I'm, I'm really happy. I mean, you can, if you know somebody, you know them from behind. And that right there is Todd, uh, Terry Connor, Todd Connor's dad. That's the way I remember them. And uh, we all miss him. I still have the ears to do. And uh, let me tell you how I worked this out. I knew the face was going to be five inches from the uh, top of the head to the bottom of the chin. And so I made all these faces here the side views and the front view of his face five inches from the top of the head to the bottom of the chin and lined them all up and that way I could take my measurements off that because I didn't have Terry here obviously he's we're having his memorial tomorrow I printed off hundreds were well not hundreds but dozens of photographs of him and uh, he had extremely wide shoulders this gentleman actually, uh, uh, in a match, fought uh, Chuck Norris many years ago, if you can believe that. It's unbelievable. His life was, uh, well, somebody could write a book, I'm sure, about his life. But he always wore ball caps, and that's what I try to do is uh, put that ball cap on. But I, I just got every view I could, and some of these were recent pictures, which make, he was about 10 years older than in some of the pictures, but uh, I needed to see detail like his eyes and his mouth and all that. He was a handsome gentleman. He was uh, almost 80 years old. He was, I think, 78, 79 years old, but I'm not certain on that. But... Uh, Every angle I, I could find, uh, Todd Connor gave me his pictures, and he said he had this kind of a sneer-type smile and with a little bit of teeth showing, and uh, he wanted me to try to get that, and I think I got it. But anyway. <sighs> All right, well, 
It's after midnight now, and I'm going to go to bed after I post this video. I still got work to do on the face, but I don't think I did too bad for nine hours work. I still got work on the ears. I have probably, I, mean, I know I got detail on the face I got to do, especially his nose. And uh, Todd Connor will look at it tomorrow, but uh, we're going to be showing this at the memorial tomorrow, and I just wanted to get it to this point at least. I'm sorry I didn't video it. Uh, I just didn't have the time to sit, you know, set up the cameras and all that stuff. I was busting my tail. I mean, I cut my hand several times. I had blood all over this uh, foam under the uh, clay here because I cut my hand on a, on the knife that I was cutting the foam with. But uh, I'm okay. I just it was a stressful day. That's all. At one point, I was ready to throw in the towel and say I can't do this. But it worked out. All right, everybody. I'll see you tomorrow. Well, I'll see you next time. Give me a thumbs up and share my video. And then check out my instructional DVDs. Uh, the link down below this video. All right. See you next time.